If you think Inside Out is just a fun kids movie, think again. Psychologists sometimes use it to help clients understand emotions. In the next 90 seconds, I'm going to use this film, which psychologists often prescribe to their clients, to explain how meditation reduces overall anxiety and shifts the way we think. Ready? Let's go. Most of our brains are wired to connect events directly to consequences. This is often explained by the ABC model. A is the antecedent, the event. B is your belief, your thoughts about the event. C is the consequence, your emotional and physical reaction. Here's a classic anxiety loop. A, antecedent. Your boss or coach sends a message. We need to talk tomorrow. B, belief. Your brain immediately catastrophizes. I'm getting fired. I'll be broke. I'll get evicted. My partner will leave me. No one will ever love me. C. Consequence. Your evening is ruined. Your hands shake. Your heart races. You can't sleep. And your body is flooded with the stress hormone, cortisol. Now, sure, breathing exercises, cutting sugar, or skipping coffee are helpful, but they don't fix the root problem. They just lower the anxiety level for a moment. The real root of the problem is that your amygdala, your brain's fear and anxiety center, has hijacked your prefrontal cortex, PFC, the logical decision-making part. The problem is jumping from one simple email to total life ruin. This is precisely where meditation helps. In these moments, it's critical to keep your PFC active. Meditation is the practice of doing just that. It trains you to observe events and your thoughts and feelings about them without adding judgment. You learn to see the event, the email, as just an event. You see the anxious thought, I'm getting fired, as just a thought, not a fact. Meditation allows you to see things as they are, not worse than they are, breaking the chain reaction before it floods your system.